I made a Stephen Curry, but 99 overall everything. 99 everything. Get dunk. Um, so it was a creative player. We made him. We added him to the free agent pool. And we got him. This is literally the best player. I pretty much said my face. I need my face to be clear. Okay, so your face over any moves that you have? <laughs> Probably my shooting, my shooting uh, motion and uh, my jumping ability. If you were going to select a perfect my team, with you included, you had to pick four other players, past or present, who are you picking? Kari at the point guard. Yep. Uh, shooting guard, Michael Jordan. Duh. Smooth forward, me. Tim Duncan at the power forward. And center... Hakeem Olajuwon. Yeah, Hakeem Olajuwon, that's good, because he's a great defensive player. Curry at the point. And yeah. the Rockets already with their game faces on as they get off the bus. The Gotta be geared up for these road oh. contests. The beautiful, before we get going. Thanks so much. An old school approach, Allie. Thanks. Uh, and a chance to see the latest edition of the power rankings. Always fun to see where everyone in the league stands. Taking a look at Houston, they've come down in the rankings a little, landing in the fifth spot for now. Well, right now for the Warriors, they've begun this year playing with some real fire and has produced some top-notch basketball, okay. doing better than many expected. Now the starting group for the Houston Rockets. DeMar DeRozan is out there with P.J. Washington. Then it's Pascal Siakam. Then it's Fred Van Vliet. And it's Rain Man in a two-guard. And for the Warriors, Stephen Curry is out there with Green. Then there's Sadiq Bey. Then it's Giannis Antetokounmpo. Here's DeRozan, Van Vliet outside. And not gonna go, he misses his first attempt of the night. Ana Dekumpo with it, checked by Washington. Outside Curry, driving to the basket, and Curry throws it down. Oh, and that's the thing about Steph, famous on the floor, but also plays under control. And so it's Houston with it. They're coming off that loss against Philadelphia. I really think that L has to fall on their defense, or a lack thereof. Just not enough focus at that end of the floor. See, That's just the communication and, and the energy. It just seemed non-existent on defense, and that can't happen. Not at this level. Just five to shoot. Here's Washington. And he can't get that one. And Golden State will go the other way with it. They're getting their first look of the season at the Rockets in this one. And they were the odds-on favorite in this matchup last year, but actually lost the yeah, season so series. And dominating also. at a mid-major university. Some scouts question Siakam's level of competition during the 2016 draft process, especially since his numbers were so good. He's also got Max Curry against Van Vliet. Shot is good by Curry. Curry's got six. And it's the Rockets with the ball. Siakam outside. About two minutes gone by in the first quarter. Three-pointer Van Vliet nails it from beyond the arc. Also affecting Siakam's draft stock, huh? He was three or four years older than many of his peers. Well, what's interesting is that player evaluation has become such a science. But sometimes the variables can lead you astray. You have to go by the eye test. Siakam was in that cohort. He's not easing his way into this game. He's coming out hot. Four for five right out the game. Elbow shot on the way. Again, Houston. Yeah, I'm surprised that D isn't respecting this mid-range game more. Uh, they ought to be. Uh, I bet you they will be soon. To the paint. Outside for Green. Bay from long range. And the Warriors with another three. Well, this is what makes Curry special on offensive end. The ability to create for himself and others at the highest level of the game. Three-pointer Van Vliet. And it falls for him. He's hit three of his first four attempts. <laughs> That's how you up the ante. Come right back at him. Yeah, every bad jet he has. Let's talk about the great competition. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Okay. I see it. Oh, okay. Dallas Curry has is insane. He's not going to overpower you with the strip, but he stays in control. Oh, doing damage above the rim. That was our AT&T 5G slam cam. Now here's Van Vliet. He's guarded closely. Siakam, no good. The Warriors have gone six of seven and looking good. The three is up. And it's Stephen Curry with the three. 14 points for him. Well, with the role he's on 
of this quarter. They're, they're going to keep going to him. Get that lead even bigger. Houston calls timeout. Well, we've got some hot starts and some ugly starts early in the season. Grant, how long should teams wait before worrying about their record? Well, it's simple, B.A. If you have a bad record, you should always be worried. <laughs> but most GMs don't think about making changes until about the halfway mark. I look now at the leaderboard to see which teams had the toughest defenses this past season. In the third spot, the Warriors. Houston, fourth. And what stuck out to me is how intense both of these teams were on D last season. Neither giving up many points to opposing teams. Here's Van Vliet. Curry with the block. Oh, look at that. You see, you see, that shows what kind of athlete Curry is. His quickness to the ball. Get that shot out of here. And that one's good. And Green with the assist. Curry's got 17. They're getting torched on the perimeter. Four of the last five buckets have been threes. Van Vliet outside. They need this. Pulled the shot a little left. The bounce goes his way, though. He's wrapped up his game in a big way this quarter. I don't think he likes it when they're trailing. Curry passes to Green. And the three off target. Houston has gone two for two from deep to start this one. Bay against DeRozan. Van Vliet outside. Another three from Houston. Taking things into his own hands. He's been a beast this quarter. Curry passes to Green. Now Curry. 32 points for him. Last game against Milwaukee. Sometimes Curry finishes with the clever lane. Other times, he viciously dunks it home. The Rockets trail. Van Vliet up top. Green covering. And the basket by Van Vliet. 15 points in the game. Oh, that's just a terrific night for him from the floor. Making almost everything he looks at. Ooh, took him no time at all to get that one. It's been a dominant night for him. Staying productive throughout. Pass to DeRozan. Siakam with it. We saw him with 11 points in his last game. Here's Rain Man. Clock at six. Three-pointer Van Vliet. Another three from Houston. He's seven out of nine from the field to start off. Great output. Curry drives in. And Curry throws it down. Curry just shows us why. It is a terrific night for him. To the middle. Here's Van Vliet. Good. And it's DeRozan who picks up the assist. Van Vliet's got 20. Just owning the painted area. If it's working, no need to change. The three from Curry. Rockets with a rebound. Siakam gets double. Ooh, and he took a hard foul on the shot. So he'll head to the line to shoot a pair. It's on Stephen Curry. And a chance for a moment to check out the scoring breakdown for the Warriors. They've carried out a great game plan in the paint so far. Working it down low a lot and getting high percentage looks. Also, their aggressiveness in the first half tonight has allowed them to score more than a few points off penetration. He's pulling out all the tricks this court. They can't figure out how to stop him. DeRozan outside. Pass to Siakam. And here's Van Vliet. To the left side wing. Here's Rain Man. He had a 12-point outing in their last game against Philadelphia. Yeah, but it wasn't all about himself. I mean, he kept everybody else in the loop. His passing was tremendous. I already got two points. Here's Green. The lead is two. On the wing, Curry. Guarded by Van Vliet. From behind the arc. That's good from Curry. On the assist from Bay. That's 29 for him. Yeah, he's in his bag from beyond the arc right now. You see his confidence. The basket looks as big as the ocean right now. I mean, that's how easy he's making it look. And there's another one for the Warriors. I mean, that's good as soon as he leaves his fingers. I mean, I think I'm going to miss that. Houston has gone four for four so far from three-point land. Impressive. Houston calls timeout.
Man, it's been quite a game for Stephen Curry. No, they can't leave him alone for a second on the perimeter. Not the way he's shooting the three tonight. Here's Wagner down low. Pass to Rainman. Here's Murphy. And a missed layup. They say there are no easy finishes in the NBA, but that's <laughs> I tell you, a little extra pressure on D when you're up against a point guard who can elevate. <laughs> it doesn't make it easy, does it? And guys, it's clear though, he enjoys showing off his athleticism. The D can't give him these opportunities. Here's Rain Man. Green covering. Inside to end the run. Murphy's shot is good. Is to... When they get their opportunity to punch it inside, they don't hesitate. Outside Curry. Three-pointer. Another three for Golden State. And the defense is really allowing them too much room on the perimeter. Houston's shooting a phenomenal 60% on the first. That one's good for two. And their offensive game plan is clear. Get it inside and go to work. Here's Curry with the drive. And Curry throws it down. Something right when you find yourself up double digits in the first period. Yeah, true. But now it's about sustaining their energy and maintaining the focus. To the inside, there's the kid. And that one makes him two for two. He's in his rhythm. And force feeding the ball inside. I mean, no reason to go away from what's working. Drive by Curry. And Curry throws it down. They've shown so much energy right from the start, particularly on the offensive end. Yeah, they've been very aggressive, and they've taken early control of this game. Pass to Murphy. Here's the kid. 11 points for him last game against Philadelphia. Five on the clock. Here's Wagner. The shot, no good. So Golden State will take it the other way. And Curry throws it down. And add an exclamation point by Steph, a much better athlete than most people realize. Houston has gone four for four so far from three-point land. Impressive. Here's the kid. Three-pointer. Oh! And Coach doesn't like the call at all. He's opting to use his challenge. He wants the officials to look at the replay. And even with the coach's challenge in place, we've seen so many of these personal foul calls still disputed even after the video review. There's no doubt there's going to be a gray area in a lot of these calls. But at least we have the option to take a second look. So the officials can be sure they get it right. And they've made their decision. The call will stand. And as much as it hurts to lose a challenge, I think coach would challenge that call again if he could. He really disagreed with the foul, and he's still peeved. He love players like Wagner who are always ready to play. He's shown he can come off the bench hot and deliver big points. Two minutes remaining in the first. Two minutes. It's stolen away. Inside, here's Murphy. Good D by Finney Smith. Outside Curry. There's the three. Another three for Golden State. They've really built this lead on the back of their perimeter game. Oh, yeah, they certainly found something along the perimeter. Just an onslaught of three-point bombs. Here's Murphy. Nine points in his last outing. Pass to Wagner. To the wing on the left. Shot clock at six. Offensive rebound. Yep, that one goes. So far, rebounding has been a focal point for them. Here's Curry. And the sweet roll that time on the rim. That one falls. Curry's got 44. This has been just a dreadful start for them defensively. Not good at all. Here's the kid. He's covered by Curry. There's the drive. 
Goes up and lays it in nice and easy. Curry's got 46. <laughs> Their offense looking like a well-oiled machine. Here's the kid. Pass to Wagner. Takes the three. Can't get it to go. Make it a 0 for 2. Eight second difference between the shot clock and game clock. Curry goes in. And Curry throws it down. Give their offense some love. They've been the more efficient team. Yeah, and it's because of the looks they're getting. Their offense is creating some great opportunities. And the Rockets with possession here. Trailing by 17. Here's the kid. He's covered by Curry. To the middle. Here's the kid. Tries again. And he takes it up and lays it in. He has six. He's got the hot hand right now. As long as he can keep getting open, they've got to keep feeding him. Right side Curry. Takes it inside. Oh! Dunk it a foul! A powerhouse move! He's got a chance for one more at the line. Defensive foul. Kevon Looney Kevon picks one up. That's his first personal foul. First team foul. And that one falls for Curry. I expect to see Bigfoot outside the building if Curry misses one or two free throws in the game. That's how good he is at the line. Stephen Curry getting it done for the Golden State Warriors. He's now hit six threes in this game. Knows he has the green light to fire away. Back after this. And all those dunks that he piled up. Mm-hmm. We welcome you back to second quarter action. Plenty of basketball left to play, but this one has been one-sided so far. Boy, for the Warriors, this has been the game they've wanted to have. Great offensive energy in that period. They're clearly on a mission. Yeah, now they got to find a way to keep it going. Keep throwing that lead. We've got Green. He's out there with Stephen Curry. Johnson is out there with Otto Porter. That's the group for Golden State as we kick off the second quarter. Here's Murphy. He's guarded by Porter. Murphy's shot is off. Outside Curry. Poke loose. And he banks in the layup. Curry's got 53 points. And they keep on figuring out ways to force the rock inside and convert. Going inside. And he'll draw the foul. He'll head to the line for two. And Chris, during your career, you were one of the game's best on the boards. Talk about traits needed to rebound at a high level. I mean, first thing people talk about is size. But look, look at Russell Westbrook. I mean, he has the instincts, the toughness, the, the, the want to. Uh, any great rebound, you have to share those traits. All right, the Rockets making a switch here. Washington's checked in. Here's Curry. And Curry throws it down. Having the aggressiveness of Curry. Able to drive and convert against some pretty solid defense. Look at his shot. Russell Westbrook great. Quarter number two with just over a minute of play. Pass to Washington. And that one's good. That makes him two for three. They're punishing those late defensive rotations. Getting good looks inside throughout the half. The three from Curry. Another three for Golden State. Even with all the threes he nailed in the first quarter, the defense still hasn't made the proper adjustments. Green against Allen. Pass to the kid. Driving inside. And he gets it to go. Four for six so far. He's so aggressive at that end of the floor. And that's a quality all great scores have. And out of bounds. Houston will have it. Houston ball. Here's what the Houston Rockets have lined up on their schedule. On Wednesday, they continue the road trip, heading out to Phoenix to take on the Suns. And then on Friday, they'll go up against Clay Thompson and the Sacramento Kings. The road is never the highlight of your schedule for any team. But for these guys, it is a chance to go out there, test themselves, and see how well they gel outside of home court. It could be a very valuable experience. And the Warriors making a switch here. Bay's checked in. Outside, green. Pass to Bay. The kick out, Curry. Stolen by Siakam. 
Here in quarter two, we've played a little over two and a half minutes now. Rebounded by Johnson. <laughs> I'll tell you what, they've rebounded the ball tremendously well. Curry drives in, and Curry throws it down. What a finish. I mean, he just took over himself. What a show of power right there from the point guard. Man, sweet. No, but his teammates love that kind of energy, fellas. I mean, dunks like this demonstrate leadership. And there's the call on Sadiq Bey. That's his first foul. And the Warriors making a change here. Anadokounmpo's checked in. Pass to Van Vliet. Five to shoot. And another miss by Houston. Oh, man, as good of a shooter as he is, it drives him crazy to miss a wide-open three like that. The three from Curry gets the three ball to go. He's carried much of the scoring load tonight. And with the win in reach, don't expect him to let up. Timeout, timeout. timeout call. Timeout. Houston. Man, it's been quite a game for Martin. Stephen Curry. Oh, yeah, no question what they'll be talking about in this timeout. They need to figure out some way to slow him down. You have on your feet and you welcome your Warriors. And with a pause in the action, here we have the best yes. rebounding team from last year. The Warriors, second. Their effort on the boards was a point of pride for them. They play a physical style, and it served them well. Green finds Ana de Kumpo. And a deep three from Curry. Good. And Ana de Kumpo gets the assist. Ana de Kumpo has got his third assist of the night. Shot to stop the run, and it's laid up and in by DeRozan. DeRozan's got his first basket. And DeRozan, just so crafty on those moves, slips right through the contact for the finish. Shot's good by Kumpo. Their offense is looking like a well-oiled machine, getting any look they want. Yeah, right now it feels like they can't miss. We'll see how long they can make this last. Siakam, no good. They really have a commanding lead, not just in points, but in rebounds as well. And here's Curry for three. Connects again from distance. Buries his 10th triple of the game. Unbelievable, B.A., unbelievable. Van Vliet outside. Pass to Allen. Washington against Porter. Washington passes to Van Vliet. 11 feet out. Curry with the block. And they're able to recover. DeRozan. It's rebounded by Golden State. They defeated Milwaukee in their last game. <laughs> and in that game, they owned the glass. Most of the second chance opportunities went to them. Yeah, if, if you can be that much better on the glass, you're going to win the game. Boy, they'd love if anyone could get a bucket. Yeah, their offense has been grinding to a halt. Siakam in the post. Hunter Nakupo's there. And there's a whistle. He'll head to the line to shoot two. It's on Stephen Curry. Well, I like that Washington isn't afraid to work. He clashes with the defender, but still gets a shot for the Rockets. <laughs> They've been impeccable from the line here in the second period, doing what they can to try to build some momentum. The three from Curry. And yes, another basket. What a game from him. 72 points. And he's been simply sensational throughout this one. Here's DeRozan. Rejected by Antetokounmpo. A defensive player of the year winner. Antetokounmpo affects so many shots with his length. A tremendous mobile one block that we had to see again. Great send back. Yeah, good offense comes from great defense. This lead is only getting stronger with plays like that. Washington's shot is good. Now the Warriors with it. They're on a 16-6 run. And defying the analytics trend, DeRozan's favorite shot still remains the mid-range jumper. I mean, they've tried to stretch him out with uneven results. Maybe better to surround him with three-point shooters, create space in the medium range area to maximize his effectiveness. Count that one. Siakam's got four points now in the quarter. Inside Siakam gets the better of the defense using his agility, clearing himself a path to a shot. Bay outside. Back to Curry from outside the arc. Good! Another from three. He's been on the money from deep. Definitely looking to shoot as much as possible. So 81 is third. Pass to Rainman. Back to Van Vliet. 
Curry with some nice D. He's not an easy man to stop when he's attacking the basket. The D doing everything he can. Puts up a three. And again for three. And this is a historic shooting night for him. Tied for third now for most threes in a game. And the points keep piling up and the threes keep dropping in. He is red hot from downtown. Here's Rain Man. Pass to Siakam. Second chance shot. Curry with the block. And it's out of bounds. Last touch by Curry. And the Rockets making a change here. Wagner's checked in. Houston has gone four of six from three-point range thus far. Let's go now to the sideline and catch up with Ali LaForce. In 2016, the NBA Players Association made history, voting to extend health insurance to retired players with at least three years of service. Chris Paul said, quote, they paved the way for our game. This is just the little that we could do. Whenever my tenure is up as president of the union, that will be easily the greatest achievement. Brian? Boy, that is big time, Allie. Good stuff there. Thank you for that. Here's Rain Man. Golden He's State covered foul. by Curry. And it's Dorian, Dorian Finney-Smith with the foul. That's his first personal That's foul. His first foul. Team's fourth. DeRozan outside. Over on Adekumpo. And he's having an ugly quarter from the field. And seems really frustrated. Pass to DeRozan. Oh, persistence pays off as they finally hit a shot. That's exactly what the coaching staff wants to see out of DeRozan. The hair trigger release. The disciple. And it's good. He hits another one. And that score moving him clear into third. All time for scoring. Well, you just knew it was a matter of time, the way he's been playing. I'm sure he's not finished. And they're plus five on the boards after that rebound. Fires for three. Connects again from distance. I don't think I've ever seen a player this dialed in from deep. And by the way, with that make, he's now alone in second place for most threes in a game. At this point, you have to go for that top spot, right? Van Vliet, the pass to Siakam. And his struggles continue offensively. He's been just a little off the mark tonight. Really the story of the game so far. Down low. The kick out. Curry beyond the arc. Another three for Golden State. All five of the last buckets they've given up have been from downtown. Here's Rain Man. Green covering. Pass to Van Vliet. Hits a three-pointer. Van, Van Vliet's got 29 points. points. It's turned into a showdown here. Dueling from distance. But it's a matter of pride and a matter of each side trying to seize control of this game right now. Oh, he did everything right there except hit the shot. The Warriors pull it in. Oh, Kumpo has got four rebounds in the game. That's another bucket. That's 91. An incredible feat. Incredible indeed. This is just a flat-out insane performance. Here's Rain Man. Green covering. And blocked. That one goes careening off the glass. Curry passes to Green. Over Siakam. Off the left rim and out. Houston has gone two of three from the three-point line in the second. To the paint. The kick out to Van Vliet. Two minutes in the first half. Siakam in the post. Green covering. Goes back up. And the layup is good. Siakam's got eight points. A fantastic athlete. You love the effort Siakam shows on the glass to keep plays going. Outside Finney Smith. Green, the pass to Anadokounmpo. Let's it fly. And it's good. Yes. Off the back rim and in. Anadokounmpo has got four points oh, now in the quarter. Seven. Even a blind squirrel finds an acorn once in a while, right? I did not think that was going on. Now here's DeRozan. He's marked by Finney Smith. Here's Wagner. And it's rejected. Shot from the wing. And the Warriors get it back. 
Here's Curry. And that one's good. And Green with the assist. If they close this win out, I know who my MVP is. His offensive performance tonight has been unreal. Curry against Van Vliet. Curry with some nice D. Now the Warriors with it. Their next game playing at home as the Grizzlies come to town. And they'll be nearing the end of their five-game homestand. Hits the trifecta. He's dropping the three ball with incredible consistency. What a barrage here in the first half. Trying to find a spark here. Yes, indeed. A rough stretch offensively. They could really use a basket. That's the shot they wanted. It just didn't fall. No, you're right. He'd take that 10 out of 10 times. He's not going to miss many of those. Siakam. And too long on the shot. His interior scoring is one of the things that drives their offense. Don't expect him to miss many of those. Curry, that's good. They've been very well-rounded and extremely focused. Yeah, and it hasn't just been the offensive output. They're putting in the work at the defensive end as well. Jumps up. Yet another bucket. He is ripping through this defense and continues his assault on the record books. Hey, and that score moves him into second place for most points in a game. DeRozan for three. And through the first half, a pretty lopsided affair. The Warriors on top, running away with this one. I did not expect to see the upside for the shoot, get the rebound, pass up. The 2K Sports Halftime Show. What a start it was for Stephen Curry. He dropped a ton of bombs on him from long range. Six to be exact. That's doing some serious. That was in the first And with the second half upon us, we'll find out if this game becomes the route that it's threatening to be. Stephen Curry having a dominant impact in this game. Yeah, but his blocks tell only part of the story. His presence alone is making an impact on defense. The blocks are impressive, no doubt, but his intimidation factor actually prevents certain shots from ever being taken at all. Taking a look at the Rockets, we've got Fred Van Vliet, P.J. Washington out there with Pascal Siakam. Then it's DeMar DeRozan, and it's Rain Man in at the two. Puts it up from 15. The basket drops, and he gets fouled on the shot. That's One free throw coming his way. That was it, a shooting foul? At the line for the Rockets, DeMar DeRozan at the line for one. That's good from DeRozan. You know, DeRozan has been lucky. He gained so much valuable experience in his career, playing on diverse all-star and Olympic teams. Curry passes to Anadokounmpo. That drops, and it comes off an assist from Curry. Curry's got six assists in the game. And just not letting up at all. I mean, you have to love this approach. You want to get the ball to the guys who make plays. You have to go to your best scores. I mean, it's a smart strategy, and so far, it's paying off in this game. And a minute played as the second half gets going. Good! Another from three. There it is. A shot that puts him tied at the top of the record books. And he just can't be denied from deep. Now he's tied for most threes in a single game. Amazing. Pass to Rainman. Back to Van Vliet. Shot clock at five. 14 feet away. Is that rejected by me? We're just about a minute and a half into the third quarter of basketball. Oh, handles for days, handles for days, handles for days. Steph Curry can change pace and speed on you in a flash. The Rockets have gotten only one of four shots to fall in the second half. Pass to Rain Man. Now DeRozan. He's covered by Bay. To halt the run. And there's the play by DeRozan inside. DeRozan's got five points now in the quarter. 
that's a perfect setup. Solid screen. Defender can't avoid it. Opens up a clear path to the bucket. Curry. That's good. Oh, under intense defensive pressure. Steph rises above. For Houston, they've gone two of five in this third quarter. Van Vliet outside. A green matchup. Here's Rain Man. Green covering. Washington outside. Ooh, a little luck that time as it drops. Washington's got 10 points. But you can't let Washington get comfortable. I mean, off a of feed, PJ is, is a better shooter. Oh, got that one up quick. They've had a hard time shutting down the three-point shot. The Rockets have gotten three of six shots to fall so far in the third. Pass to Rain Man. Here's Van Vliet. Anadokounmpo grabs the board. Anadokounmpo's got six rebounds here tonight. And they're up considerably because of their efforts on the glass. Curry from deep three-point land. Connects again from distance. Unbelievable. Gets the record with a beautiful three. A new single-game record and a night that everyone will remember the rest of their lives. And listen to this crowd. Letting him hear it. Uh, as well they should. One of the great three-point shooting displays in league history. Yeah, if I'm him, I'm shooting every time I get it. It is just a, an incredible night for him. And there's still time left. Porter Jr., he's checked in for the Warriors. Here's Rain Man. Green covering. Pass to Looney. And the rebound goes to the Warriors. And the Warriors with possession. They're on a 17-7 run. And Curry throws it down. A big knife for him. Most points in the game, and they just cannot figure out a way to stop him. Here's Rain Man. Green covering. Pass to the kid. Fires the three. The Rockets with another miss. <laughs> That's exactly how you have to defend him on the perimeter. Can't allow any space. Hey, Jalen Green kind of started his career with a big moment, being the first player to join the Ignite team in the G League. We got a taste of the NBA style of play. Boy, they need something to go to regain some confidence. No question. Way too many empty possessions for them. And Stephen Curry again. Curry's got 18 points in just the second half. You got to be careful around Curry. He has outstanding court awareness, and therefore, he times his steals perfect. The seasoning Jalen Green picked up in the G League really did help strengthen his game. Yeah, but yeah, I mean, what a great opportunity for him to grow as a player, allowing him to continue sharpening his skills by playing against league caliber talents. And Grant, you've been around the game in so many roles. Been a player, broadcaster, owner. Talk about how the game has grown and the opportunities for continued growth. Well, we know how the game here in the U.S. has really gained prominence and is hugely successful and popular. And I also think that's happened over the years globally as well. We're continuing to popularize the game in Africa, India, China, and elsewhere is exciting. There are so many new frontiers for this league to grow, and I'm excited that we're moving forward in that direction. Coming out of the break red hot. I mean, they have yet to miss a shot. Pass to the kid. That's tipped. It's stolen by Green. With his first shot attempt. Nice spin off the oh, left rim and in. He drops yet another dive. Just facilitating this offense like a maestro. From about 19. And Bay pulls it down. Golden State has got it going from the perimeter in the third. Four for four so far. And Curry throws it down. He is the story for them offensively. And a big reason why they're ahead. Here's Allen. Well, quiet so far offensively, searching for his first points of the game. Here's the kid. Ten points for him. Six on the shot clock. Porter pulls it in. They're enjoying a sizable lead. 
And what I like, B.A., they haven't stopped pressing the issue. And Curry throws it down. Since halftime, they have been efficient and effective, making Coach very happy. Oh, just a dream scenario for them so far. Their offense looking like a well-oiled machine. Allen against Green. It's stolen by Green. And the Warriors pushing it up now. Outside Curry. From 12 feet. And he gets it to go. Hitting off the back of the rim. And a chance to catch up on some numbers here. The hustle stats for the Warriors. Well, they played a heads-up brand of basketball this entire Three game. Steals. And they've got the steals to prove it. You also can't overlook how well they've defended the rim as they've challenged every shot and blocked quite a few tonight. And that's what happens when you don't take care of the ball. Hey, that makes the turnover hurt even more. Yeah, going so defense to offense in an instant. Seven, Every third. team now calibrates for that. And with plenty of time third, left, that's foul. his fourth foul. So he needs to stay cognizant away. of that moving forward. Murphy. Yep. And a Seven. nice finish on the layup. Robert. Six Robert. points for him. Tremendous feed from Looney. He's not thinking about himself. He's scanning the floor, looking to Green for his teammates. Here's Green. Count that bucket. You know, they're really being bullied right now defensively. Eight of the last ten points have come from inside. And an intentional foul right there. You don't want to stop the clock right there. I'm not quite sure what he was thinking. Stephen Curry, he's checked in for Green. Wagner's checked in for the Rockets. Houston has gotten six of ten three-pointers to drop. Down low. Here's the kid. Good. That's his fifth bucket in nine attempts. As hot as he's been, it, it still has to be him who leads the charge and helps turn this game around. Curry passes to Porter. Launches a three. The shot misses. Now the Rockets take it the other way. Pass to Wagner. Now here's Looney. The Warriors pull it in. Curry's got four rebounds now. Driving in. And Curry throws it down. Now, I know he makes it look easy, but it takes incredible physical tools to pull that off. Athleticism and explosion. Let's take another look at the staunch defense during that mobile one block. Oh, amazing indeed. And getting stops like that only encourages him to keep attacking on the offensive end. Rocket basketball. Here's Wagner. Lays it up and banks it in. They've now had assists on each of their last three buckets. Now here's Curry. Non-stop scoring machine right here. Hits yet again. Wow. And he's been dominant so far in this one. Shouldering the offense. Really taking it to the opposition. He's covered by Bay. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. That's his first personal foul. The first free throw is good. Team foul. At the line for the Rockets, Quentin Grimes. Two shots. Second free throw, no good. Golden State has gotten four threes to fall out of five attempts here in the third. Here's Curry. And that one goes in as he's fouled. It'll be three points if he converts the free throw. Defensive foul. And that one falls for Curry. The Rockets have gotten seven of 16 shots to go so far in the third quarter. Here's the kid. He's covered by Curry. Here's Murphy. Six points for him. Four on the clock. Late clock. Houston's got to hurry. The three-pointer off the mark. Just enough of a shot contest to bother him. And he got the whistle on the way up. The so he'll be headed to the line for a pair. <laughs> oh, man. The shiftiness of Steph. The quick trigger. Hard got to defend without fouling. And so Curry nails both of them. Houston has gone 0 for 2 from outside here in the third. Here's the kid. He's covered by Curry. Pass to Looney. Drop 
Drops in the three. He's got six. But the D didn't do a good enough job on him. He could be an ace when he gets a good look at three. They double-team Curry. Outside Porter. Back to Curry. The baseline, Jay. This is oh, off the right iron. He fell to the Houston ground. has gotten seven of 12 three-point attempts to fall. For three, another three from Houston. And the action on hold. It appears there's been an injury. Yep, he's definitely in a bad way out there right now. Man, that's tough to see. And by the look of it, guys, this could be serious. Oh, that's a tough blow for him. Really, the whole team, though. I mean, puts a lot of pressure on the next man up. Finney Smith this checked this in for the Warriors. Eight. James oh. comes in for Curry. Oh, yeah, what I was talking about earlier. Out of the Kumpo, outside. In the third, two minutes. The three. The kid with a rebound. Houston has gotten two of four threes to fall here in this third quarter. 146 left in the third quarter. Clock at six. Using his post moves to get the two points. They're really looking to that inside game here in the second half, getting away from taking a bunch of threes. Here's on it, Akumpo. And the foul is called. He missed it, so he's got a couple of free throws coming his way. So many times, Giannis forces his man into a foul. As a defender, you can't give him anything easy. That leads to a lot of contact. And so on it, Akumpo nails both of them. 124 left in the third. And the Rockets shooting about 43% on this one. Siakam. And a great assist by Van Vliet as that one goes. Van Vliet's got three assists now in this one. Golden State has gotten 12 of their points this quarter from deep. Four of six. And the shot goes down. anacupo has got 10. And the balance Giannis has. Outstanding job taking the contact and finishing despite it. Three-pointer Van Vliet. Another three from Houston. Oh, he's been as dependable as he always okay, is. He can't do it all by himself, though. They've got a commanding lead. It just seems like everything is going their way. Finney Smith's shot is off. Houston with the ball. They're on a 13-4 run. They grab their own miss. Rejected by Anna Kumpo. On the wing, Finney Smith, guarded by Van Vliet. And that one drops. He's got 12. Just consistent and pretty much automatic. Antetokounmpo may be the league's most efficient scorer inside 10 feet. And so it looks like it'll be Houston's ball. Houston ball. We've got 22 seconds left to play in the third. Now here's DeRozan. The D's right on him. Five on the clock. Over Finney Smith. And it's DeRozan missing. Here's James. And he banks in the layup. James has got his first two points of the night. And the defense has no one to blame but themselves. I mean, they just let him get right to the rim. Yeah, yeah. Horrible effort. It appears they may be on the brink of giving up. And so it's the Golden State Warriors way out of reach with an enormous lead as we head into a break. It hasn't taken them too many shots to get their points. They're winning with efficiency. All right, we'll get back to the action after this break. All right, let's take a look at our assist of the game presented by State Farm. Now, I know he's a big man, but he's got some point guard in him if he's making passes like this. This is where the NBA's headed. I mean, multi-dimensional big men. That was just a beautiful pass. Alright, we're actually going to play the rest of this game. See you guys later. Uh, let's... Some to end. Did we win? I hope we won. Unknown right ankle... Steph Curry, of course he's gonna be wearing a blender. Okay, see you guys later.